In this video, we're going to look at three Google search operators that can help refine your searching. We'll look at exclude, synonyms, and exact phrase. So let's start with exclude. Let's say we're wanting to search about big cats, and particularly jaguars, and find out how fast they go. So, in google.com.au, and we put in jaguar and speed. The trouble with the search like this is, when you have those homograph words, because we know Jaguar can mean with a big cat, but it can also mean a car. So what we can do to target our search down is actually use the minus sign to say we don't want to include sites that have the word car in it. So now when we search, the results we get will be to do with animals rather than to do with cars. Okay, so that's the exclude or minus sign. Let's do another one, this time looking at synonyms. What about if we actually want to include more words to extend our search? So let's say we want to have a look at mobile phone. This time we're actually going to use the tilde symbol, which you can often find at the top left of your keyboard and looks a little bit like this. And I'm going to search for mobile phone. By using the tilde symbol, it'll use lots of similar words or synonyms, things like cell, cellular, wireless, to help expand my search and give me more information. And there we go. Lots of information in there for mobile phones and going into broader words as well. So that can be useful when you want to extend your search beyond a specific word. So that's the tilde or synonym search operator. Okay, last one. We're going to use exact phrase. Normally when you search with Google, it filters out words that it doesn't think are useful. The, and those sorts of words, but sometimes you want to use specific words to be able to pin something down. And one example might be you want to try and find out where a quote came from or lyrics to a song. So let's go in and use our um, speech marks to put in a lyric from a song. I once was lost, but now am found. And close it off with our speech marks. So we're asking to search for those specific exact phrase and now when we search it finds a song for us straight away. So three ways you can refine your search by excluding with the minus symbol, by adding in synonyms with the tilde symbol or by using exact phrase with the speech marks.